Hello, my name is Alan and I am the owner of GoThrough. In this uh, video, we're going to talk about the Google Map rejected uh, issue that is affecting the publishing tools uh, right now. So we have uh, the 109 panoramas in this video uh, tour and in this particular, I have like six panoramas that map, map rejected. That's 43, 46, 61, and this three. We have a green uh, trash can because originally we had it red. So I said, okay, it's green to make it stand out uh, from all the other ones. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna download um, two panoramas for us to, to do a test. And uh, the process that I would I would say would, would be upload the panoramas to uh, create the tour and go through, upload the tour to Google from go through, and then check um, check the um, um, the tour if you have any map projected panoramas. And then you start this process that I'm demoing right now. So we downloaded uh, these two uh, panoramas. And the next step would be to go ahead and upload them to Google uh, via the desktop uploader. So this is a desktop upload. I just went to the Google um, uh, My Business page, click on one pan, one image, and then just click on that icon. Now we're gonna just drag and drop these two panoramas that we just uh, downloaded from GoThrough. And done. So now what we need to do is just wait a bit for the panorama to be uh, processed on Google side. Um, after uploading the panoramas, we are redirected to the um, contribution page. And basically well, what we need to do is just reload this page uh, a bit till we see uh, the panoramas that we uploaded um, now, what we see here that with the unknown place, those are the panoramas that go through, go through uploaded and Google uh, reject them and put them into a queue list to be either manual reviewed uh, or scan later. Uh, and the reason they have um, unknown place is because we cannot upload the panorama using the, um, uh, the the place ID. So Google automatically after upload is just like taking the panorama down and we cannot associate the panel with the place. So that's why it says unknown place. Now the two panoramas that we just downloaded and uh, uploaded are, are here. And we're gonna go into go through and reload the page and we're gonna see this import extra panoramas and we're gonna, cl gonna click on this uh, button now what this button does is checks if there are any extra panoramas on Google that are not in go through and usually they are on level zero zero so we click on here and we see them those are, are the one that you know the number uh, 43 and the number 46 so 43 and 46 that are map rejected here and now are map approved here now the next step would be to delete those rejected moderate these but that's too complicated so what we do it is we create another button and then these this button basically what it does it checks if these panoramas are already in go through and if they are then we take the place id 
from this one and associated to the, the other one. And let's click on this button. And now we check everything and we finished. So if we do another reload, we deleted the panels from go through from the level zero. And now the panels from 43 and 46 are map approved. Now, since we uploaded them via the desktop, there is no link. So once we did that, all we have to do is just go back to Google and uh, click update your tour to Google Street View. And that will add the missing links to the panoramas and the tour will be uh, fully published. Now, based on my understanding uh, uh, and what I think is you're still gonna get some panoramas as map projected if you upload them via the desktop uploader. Uh, but it'll, the, the number will be very low. Now, my hint, my feeling is that Google has two filters and that filter, I don't know, it's is better. Now, again, this is a workaround, so it might stop working any any day. But that's how you fixed uh, a tour that has map projected panoramas uh, using go through.